The first most important thing we need to know in scripting is how do we create a script. All you need to do is go to your Explorer. And if you don't see your Explorer inside Roblox Studio, you can go to View and you can toggle on and off your Explorer window and the Properties window. Let's go back to the Home menu tab. Now, to create a script, it's very easy first. You just have to go to the location where you want to create your script. For example, if I'm going to create a script inside the server script service, I'm going to hover my mouse cursor over the server script service. I'm going to see a plus sign, click on the plus sign, and select script from the drop down. In case you don't see script in the drop down, for example, after you click the plus sign and you don't see script here, you can search for it, type in script here, and there it is. You can create it, you can select it from the drop down. Let me go ahead and delete the second script here. Press delete and the script is gone. We have created our script in Roblox. We can go ahead and change the name of the script to anything we like. For example, change color. And you can change the content of the script to anything you like. For example, here's my script. That brings us to our second most important question in scripting. How do we run or execute this script? Fortunately, in Roblox, this step cannot be any easier for us because the script will run itself as the first player enters the game. Basically, there's nothing that you need to do because the script will run automatically as the server is being set up when the player, when the first player enters the game. The only thing you need to remember here is the script will only run when it is being placed in certain location. I have my script change color inside the server script service. This script will run on its own automatically when I enter the game. Let's play test and take a look. We're going to give it a few seconds and you should see the base plate. And there it is. The base plate color has changed to yellow. The script has run on its own automatically as I entered the game. The script will also run on its own when it's being placed inside the workspace. Let's take, for example, I'm going to move the script from the service script service. I'm going to place it instead inside the workspace. And now let's play and take a look. Give it a few seconds. And there it is. To test run your script, you have a few different options. Up here, where the play button is, if you click on the down arrow, you see there's a play, play here, and run. You can select any of these three options to play test your script. For example, before I do that, let me change this script here. So instead of waiting for eight seconds, and I'm not gonna go over the script right now, we're gonna do that later. I just wanna show you how to run test the script. Let's go back to our workspace, and we're gonna select run here to run the script. And there it is, it changes the color to yellow immediately. On the other hand, as I have mentioned before, the script will only run when being placed in certain places. So for example, we have placed it inside the service script service, it's gonna run automatically. Inside the workspace, it's gonna run automatically. But if you move the script to somewhere else, for example, I'm gonna place it inside the server storage now. If I press run now, you see the base plate has not changed color because the script did not run because it's being placed inside the service storage and the script inside the service storage will not run on its own. 